with home. We're with home. And we're going to show you the difference in behavior when the harness um, gets put on him. Okay, I'm reaching down to get it. And now he sees it. Can you help me with this? Mm -hmm. this is pretty good right now. <laughs> Figures. <laughs> Hi, buddy. No. Yes, and that's his golden buddy. Okay, now we have started our walk. Good boy. Good boy. Okay, he's going to continue to do this. While we go out, I'll pause it for a minute. We are now just outside on our dirt road, getting ready to walk down by the traffic. Just back and forth. Back and forth. Yeah. Okay, okay here that's we meet a neighbor's dog. Okay, this is the way the walk pretty much goes. He's actually barking at uh, nothing right now. Here comes a car. This will start him. And that's the way it goes down to the park. Okay, so now we're at the park and he's on his extender leash so he can run back and forth and this is what he does. He's like perpetual motion back and forth. So as you can see, the meds are not tiring him out. <laughs> and he will do this the whole time we're walking through the park. And he's very happy. Wasn't so happy coming here, but he's very happy now. Okay, now he's looking for the cars. If the leash ever broke, he'd be under the car in a second. <laughs> He'll tend to quiet down after the park walk when he's really tired. So he won't bark unless he sees people or cars or something that's worth barking at.